Hey everybody, in this one we will be addressing the berry and cherry light that you might get from putting too much isopropyl into your chamber while cleaning it. This happens quite often if you're just doing hot cleans with uh, isopropyl swabs. I prefer heady mops for this specifically because they're not that fat. And they So after doing the whole drying, you know, get really in there. Don't bust any of these things in there. Just gentle, but still get in there. Heady mops, easier to get into. And tighten, tighten, tighten until you are there. And boom, you're good to go. Yeah, this bowl has been killed. It's had some real damage. I had some chasing from there. I just used some magical unicorn tips and uh, it did this. So I ran out of 99.9% .9 isopropyl also, so I need to get some of that. But at least you got past the berry and cherry. So thanks for checking out the video. I'll see you in the next one.